Three. Well, we've been hunting here for four days with Yvonne and we've seen 18 bear. Every day we've had bear come in and this guy came in, gave me a perfect shot, ran 30 yards and he's beautiful. I've never seen so many bear before. Yvonne spends so much time uh, putting out trail camera pictures for us, baiting the sights. It's been an amazing hunt. Thank you. Yeah, you did a really good shot on that bear. Thank you. He went what, 40 yards max? 40 yards max. Beautiful goat. He is beautiful. All right. Thank N you. No more fun now. Let's ride that thing. Well, here with Yvonne at the Gryffindors, I've successfully killed three bears. I shot a really nice bear when I was 12. It weighed around 300 pounds and then come back the next year and harvest another nice one. And then here I am five years later, got this nice boar here. I was sitting in the tree stand around seven o'clock he came in, about an hour later he come back in and I figured, well I came to get bear so I shoot bear. And That's a nice male. Here we are. You got a long nose, huh? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you did a good shot there. Yes, sir. Let's leave it there. Well, here he is. This is my bear. We've hunted hard here for six days, Heather and I have. Heather, day four, Heather was able to take a really nice bear, uh, and it was my turn. Day five, uh, just presented no shots, but day six. This is our sixth and final day here, and, uh, and here's my bear. Huge, huge bear. Uh, this is the second male we saw today. The first male came in, uh, came, gave, gave us a shot opportunity, but uh, it was so brief, uh, we weren't able to get on with the camera. We elected to pass that bear. He was actually larger than this one. Uh, not 15 minutes later, uh, this bear came in and, and gave us some great opportunity, not six yards from the base of the tree. And uh, he, he ran maybe 20, 30 yards from our tree and expired. But this has been a phenomenal week here in La Gryffindors. I could not have asked for anything better. The accommodations, the fellowship at camp, the lodge, it's, it's, it's been great. Thank you, Yvonne. This is, uh, this is the best hunting, bear hunting experience I've ever had. I want to let you guys know, a couple nights ago, up on another mountainside, Yvonne and, and Philip put, put us on. I, uh, I was on a bait with a bear and I was shooting archery with my bow and I, uh, I used a raged mechanical broadhead and uh, we looked for a day and a half and we never got that bear even though I put a nice shot in on it. Uh, last night we retrieved this bear this morning. I used a fixed head and I recommend using fixed blades when you're bow hunting out here with Yvonne and Philip. Fixed blades are the way to go. Yeah, this, this one went, I mean, well, how to maybe 100 yards on the bait. And this, I think I think he died this morning. I mean, he dig a hole in the ground, or eat tree, you know. And so anyhow, we find you find it back. Very good. Let's go back on. Last night about 5 o'clock, his mom brought me in and set me down on a site that he'd been baiting. I had sat there a whopping 15 minutes when this bear came up. We didn't have time last night to track it down because of my negligence on so bringing a phone. But this morning we were successful in cracking it down. And it ended a good hunt for me. Yes, sir. Shot with a crossbow? Long yeah. shot, huh? Nah, not too long. <laughs> a good shot. Good shot. You did good. Yeah. Okay, we're going to skin that bear now and back to the lodge. We've had a pretty good week here. There's been nine guys in camp this week, and uh, I was the last one to collect my bear. It took uh, until Thursday to get him, but uh, nine hunters, nine bear. Uh, you can't do any better than that. The bugs are definitely here. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> you, you find you? <laughs> yeah, they find me all right. They're smart bugs. You can't hide from them. But this bear, we learned a, a big lesson here that uh, if you want to kill a bear around here, you better bring a gun. It, uh, this bear I shot with a 338 and uh, devastating <coughs> shot, and the bear still ran 60 yards. This is not really a big bear, but it's a good bear, and I'm happy with him. Everything's been good around here as far as the service and, and how they take care of you. 
the, the food and the accommodations are first rate. I'm very yeah. happy to be here. I'll be back. Thank you, Steve. We had a good time this week. Yes, we did. Yeah, enjoyed uh, enjoyed to be in the wood, you know, and seen some bear. Yep. So we're doing well. Yep. Thank you, Steve. Okay, this is my uh, successful bear hunt, and um, I wanted a bear rug, so I called uh, Rocky River Taxidermy, and I talked with Jack, the owner, yeah. and he says, if you want a bear rug, Miles, you've got to go shoot your bear. So uh, he uh, works with uh, yeah. Bon, and... Uh, I and my brother-in-law came up, and the uh, first day, um, I didn't see a bear, and uh, we took four bear the first day, and uh, the second day, um, about five o'clock, I saw this bear, and I bring him home, and um, I'd like to tell a story about my bear hunt. It was a good bear hunt, and um, you need to know the details, and uh, there's a fella up here by the name of Jack. He was wondering how I slept last night. And I told him I was all nervous about my bear hunt because I had to get the story of the bear hunt. <laughs> and the story of my bear hunt is that I, I pulled up my gun, boom! <laughs> That's End of it. story. I got bear. <laughs> I am happy. Yeah, you and, get a uh, nice, get the a nice bear. We make a nice rug too. Yeah. Okay, Thank well, you. This is uh, Tom, Tom and Jacob. It's uh, 2012. We came up here bear hunting. Cody got his bear the first evening. We all three uh, scored in 2007 and uh, all got nice bears and we all got nice bears in 2006 also. It's been a good trip so far. Waiting for the bugs to come out and get a little bit better for us. We all got a couple bites and... Uh, yeah, nothing perfect, right? Nothing perfect, but tonight's yeah. gonna be perfect because we're gonna go get two more. Yes, sir. Cody, you get a nice bear last night, Cody. Thank you. Did a good job. Good shot. Yeah, about a 20 yard shot. Went right down. Yes, sir. I love it. Yeah, first night out, bugs weren't too bad. Fighting mosquitoes all evening. And then uh, this bear came by, and I watched him walk by me. And I thought, well, you know, it's a pretty nice bear. So uh, I think I'll pass on this because I know there's a bigger bear. And then I. Uh, Got a little bit closer and I thought, well, I might as well shoot him. So I shot him right between the eyes and he dropped in his spot. That was about it. That's a nice bear. Nice male. Thank you. We went, we hired this. This is number 23 bears. With me? Yep. Man, that's a beautiful male. He's fight. You can see yep. all the scratching. Devon his... ties him up for me so I got something to shoot at every yeah, year. With, so. with the bungee, right? Yeah, <laughs> bungee cord. All right. Watching the. About 90 yards down, the bear circled around, started coming towards the bait, and I waited. I had to scope up on him, and then as he started eating the bait, and he started to back off is when I took my shot. That's a nice bear. You like to hunt with us? Beautiful hunt. Good. Every t more than I, what I expected. Thank you, Yvonne. Okay, let's go. It's a Walk thing. now. It's a <laughs> color. I had yeah. tonight my buddy Andy hunt here with his bow, and a nice bear show up. I had no time. I put the last guy in the wood, and he called me. He wanted a shot one. So that's a nice bear, man. Yeah, big. Did I a hell of a good shot. I so what? What is the story, Andy? I saw it coming through about 75 yards out to my front left, and right away I saw the big head, pumpkin head on. I knew it was a good bear. Big belly. I knew it was a nice bear. And I also had a camera and I was trying to get everything set up and at the last minute something wasn't right and it started to backpedal out on me. And I was worried it was going to go away. But just as it was backpedaling, it turned and opened up. Perfect right, nice, shot. Nice high and it only went, what do you think Yvonne, maybe? 40 yards. Yeah, not far 50 yards. I all kind of blood too. Yeah, oh, there's blood trails. Beautiful really bear, far. man. Beautiful bear. Yeah, yeah. congratulations. Thank you, Yvonne. All right, now job start. We need to drag the bear out now. You see. <laughs> <laughs> well, here it is. Um, been waiting all week. Uh, fifth day, last day of the hunt. Had two bears come in to the right of me, and uh, they went right to the bait. They uh, threw the logs off. Uh, wanted to get to Yvonne's donuts, which they liked so much, and uh, they played around. Got in a couple little arguments because uh, they wanted both wanted the food and 
the bigger bear uh, obviously won uh, trying to get to the food. Uh, she came in about 40 yards behind them, uh, came down, uh, walked around for just a few seconds, uh, and then turned around, started going back where she came from, and then she stood on all, or she stood on her back legs, stood straight up. Uh, I stood up in this tree stand and shot with my CVA muzzleloader, and she was, uh, I found her about 30 yards from where I shot her. So, nice bear, nice coat. Um, had a good time. Uh, thanks to uh, Yvonne and Philip. Uh, this is uh, this is pretty good. I'm with Yvonne, and there's no freaking bears here. <laughs> no bears. Here we go. <laughs> Cut so. two. Uh, the second night of the hunt was out last night. Didn't see anything. Got back, looked at the uh, trail cam. A bunch of bears on there. Big bears. Went out tonight in the rain, in the ground blind, and uh, was there for about two hours. She came in, right on a string, right to the bait. Beautiful smell, Mike. Yeah, right set up, 24 yards from the blind. Went shot, gave me two death moans, so I knew she was down. Went and saw her, had the gun in my hand, reloaded with the muzzle loader, and. Uh, I look up, there's another bear, 30 yards, walking right at me. That's a big male, huh? Big look male. Him out. Pulled the gun up on him, hey bear! <laughs> he looked at me, he just turned around, just walked away. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah, so no lack of bears. You did a hell of a good shot on that bear. When you think there's no bears, there's bears. Oh yeah, she went yeah. what, 30 yards, Mike? Listen, Not that, even 30, 20 yards. 20 yards, yeah. 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 Right from the, we can see her right from the bank. Yeah, and we're hunting farmland. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. We're in country, you see? Farmer just saw a big one in the field yesterday. I don't know if it's that one, but on my camera we got a few bear, a few, few big bear, yeah. female, cow, all kind. Anyhow, yeah, you did a good job, Mike. Salut. Yes, sir. 348. <laughs> 148, Bob. Yeah. 148. Hi, Bob. Take off the screen and tell me the story about that bear last night, man. You Go. want a story about the bear? Or do yes. You want a story How about, about, about you? <laughs> damn nose inside the ground blind scaring the <laughs> shit out of me and then he took off running down the bottom I think it's the same bear he come walking in front of the uh, bait mm hmm good night he yes was done yes sir was well, not a long hunt Bob nope about 20 minutes <laughs> got her at 420 I thought that Yvonne was sneaking up on me. He came right up behind the tent, or behind the ground block. Put his nose in the tent to smell you? Oh boy, he smelt me. I shit my pants. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just get the... seven o'clock, he laid down and I nailed him. Saw one about an hour beforehand. That's a nice bear, huh? Oh, yeah. You weigh what? 180-something? 186. Nice bear. Oh, yeah. Well, the first day you hunt? Yep, first day. Shot him about seven. Yeah. We did uh, shot three bear last night, find two. One of them. We had to look this morning for the, the other one, shoot with a bow. A little later. All right, let's go skin rolling. What part I start with? The part where you put me in my tree stand, <laughs> squirted me with some red stuff? <laughs> yeah, go ahead. <laughs> All right, so Master Philip, who I owe steak now to. <laughs> Brings me to the bottom because I'm too afraid to walk down by myself Because I knew this was in here obviously He sticks me up in the tree squirts me with some red stuff See ya About an hour later some rabbits and squirrels were in my bait pile They just scattered just went away. I grabbed my bow and stood up and Saw something black moving through the woods and This guy come around the corner shook like a dog because it was raining my bait hadn't been touched from the night before, and he lumbered in, walked, stood over the bait, looked right up at me, looked back down, backed up, turned around, and uh, that's when I shot. And I'm shooting a Matthew switchback and pretty light arrows and fixed broadheads. And all last night, because we couldn't look for it last night through this thick stuff, obviously I didn't hear any groan, so Philip said, let's head out and come back tomorrow. Then he made me wait. But I shot it at 5.30 and I sat in my tree stand until 10 o'clock, so 
There's a lesson in patience right there. And then uh, all this morning we dropped the guys off and came out here. And I said, that bear's 300 pounds, and I shot it behind the shoulder, and it's stuck in the opposite shoulder. And like every guide would say, yeah, I've heard that before. And hopefully when I flip it over, when we flip it over, that's where we'll find my arrow. So I'm ready to do something with this thing. and Try to lift it so we see the head. <coughs> Go ahead. Man, got a big white V on it too. Mm -hmm. Holy hell. Open his leg, front leg on the front. He's been dead for... Yeah, I know. Hours. Make you work now. See that? Yeah. Like, big white patch. Is that good? Yeah, rare like that. Great. Uh, bear hunting here in Canada. Uh, he came in about 7.30 last night. Him and about 10 million bugs. <laughs> uh, I had a good shot on him. I took it. I surprised he ran, but uh, only probably 30 yards. But it, by the time at night we look for him, too late. We find him this morning though. Yes. That's a nice bear. Nice bear. Beautiful male. Look the side of that head. I didn't know it was male or female, just big bear. It is a male. Yeah. All right, let's go drag that bear out that wood now. <laughs> 